When you were in school, do you remember shop class? I remember I used to take wood shop. Well, because of budget cuts and other factors, it's just not around in many schools anymore. But as News 5's Jesse Schultz shows us, one nonprofit is now working to change that. The group is called Moto Go, and it's teaching the kids the most basic of skills, problem solving and building with your hands. But they're not building just anything. They're building motorcycles. Molly Vaughn and Brian Schaffrin started Skidmark Garage as a place for riders to come, fix up their bikes, share parts, and their knowledge. It was successful. People from different sides of town were finding commonality. That's when the idea of Moto Go sparked. Oh, as former teachers, we both knew this was the dream in the classroom. We knew not only do kids need shop class, but they need to find places where they can work on something together and find commonality in a place outside of the classroom. The dream turned into this reality. Every week, students throughout Cleveland schools leave the classroom and head to the garage but they don't leave learning behind. They have a hands-on opportunity to do like an introduction to mechanical engineering, but do that on a Honda CB350, which is a vintage motorcycle. Hey, buddy. Putting parts of each engine together while gears in their brains are turning too. I like taking stuff apart and I like working with my hands. Everybody learning different, so like sending a class for three to four hours, doing regular like math and stuff like that. You can do the same stuff in here, they can do the same math. And you do the same stuff with the engines. Problem solving. They fail and they try again and they succeed and all of a sudden it's this redefinition of failure. And it's that discovery that makes them want to continue on this ride. We're trying to make it as affordable and as easy as we possibly can so that every single school can get shop class back in there. MotoGo is already working with several schools in Cleveland, but soon even more students will get to experience this because they are getting a mobile rig where they're going to bring all of these supplies to each school and set up shop right there. Reporting in Cleveland, Jesse Schultz, News 5.